Hallo und herzlich willkommen zurück auf Pandora. Hier ist wieder der Wizard King. Wir spielen weiter Tales from the Borderlands. Beim letzten Mal war das ja mit dem Reden nicht so viel, weil die beiden Herren hier die ganze Zeit am Erzählen waren. Mal gucken, was uns hier in dieser Wall of Curiosity jetzt so alles erwartet. Auf jeden Fall ein Haufen Skelette. Und ein Bullymon. Ugh, does every animal on this planet have to look like a giant monster? Die kennt man ja noch aus der Reihe. Lustig war der Quest mit dem Umbenennen, wo Sir Hammerlock sehr sich tausende von Namen aussucht. Kann ich hier sonst irgendwas mitnehmen? Ne, schiebt nichts aus. Alright, you know, the stuffed animals was one thing. But this is taking a turn I really don't want it to. Right this way to the world famous hall of Pandoran luminaries. Come face to face with icons of the planet's turbulent history and hear how each met their grisly fate. Please watch your step and marvel at some of the unexpected ends of life's grand design. There's nowhere else to go. Come on, let's just get through it. Okay. Okay, damit kann man noch alles scannen hier. Das ist ja auch interessant. Oh, von Oasis. <lacht> okay. Das sind ja auch coole letzte Worte. Von dem Herrn. Gucken, was man hier noch so alles angucken kann. Okay. Dann gehen wir nochmal zurück und gucken hier nochmal. <lacht> Likes his territory. Dislike sinks on his territory. Interessante Beschreibung. Sehr nervige Teile. Kann ich hier noch irgendwie Sachen angucken? Da unten was? Nee. Okay. Die Störung ist auch etwas gewöhnungsbedürftig. Naja, Bullymonks. So, dann gehen wir jetzt hier mal weiter rein. Gucken, was uns sonst, sonst so aus ein paar ausgeschopften Bullymonks, Typen, Skeletten sonst noch so erwartet. Boom, not to be confused with his brother Boom, was the first mate of Captain Flint. As his name subtly implies, Boom enjoyed hurling caustic explosives and making things blow up by any means necessary. Around here doesn't. Pandoran resident and fine dining connoisseur, Shade, was held in high esteem by his fellow neighbors. In Oasis. Not in the least bit insane. He will be missed. 
I am really not into this at all. Scheint, als sehen wir hier einige Charaktere aus den anderen Spielen. Oh, I remember this guy. He was an asshole. Formerly a scientific researcher who worked for Hyperion, Professor Nakayama was obsessed with cloning Handsome Jack, who he carried a certain fondness for. Killed by stairs. No witty rejoinder. <laughs> Killed by stairs. He must be more traumatized than I am. Hey, you still got his Hyperion ID chip? Really? Keep it. Hyperion pays out a nice bonus for recovering those things. Oops. <lacht> ja, das ist die Kästen hier sind ganz schön lustig. Der Typ war auch ein sehr lustiger Zeitgenosse. Ach. The once ruthless leader of the Crimson Lance, Commandant Steel. Her leaderness came to an end when she was skewered by a monstrous tentacle. She later died a second time after having been resurrected as some kind of cyborg zombie thing. Can we just get on with this? Wer war das bloß? Wo war mein Auge hier cool? Wie bei der Roboter-Lotion. So. Wenn mir nicht aufgetan wird, dann muss ich oh. mal selber versuchen. It's locked. Super. Oh, come on, are you serious? Well, this feels like we came in the back, so maybe there's a front door somewhere? Yeah, I don't know if we can get out there with the murderers all over the place. Maybe one of those bodies has a key or something and we just missed it. Well, I mean, if we just randomly found the key, I mean, that would be amazing. Okay, wir müssen einen Key suchen. Der hat keinen dabei. Äh, was? How are you? Not great. Are you two not just the handsomest devils I've seen in ages? <lacht> what? What? Who are you? What? 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 What is this? Is this part of the like some kind of ride or something? Since the moment we walked in, it's just been one big freaky puppet show, so Thanks. I... Thanks! I'm Shade, and this is my world of curiosities. Let me tell you right off the very bat, I am deeply sorry that you strapping young threshers of gentlemen here have to witness it in such sad disrepair. Time can take a toll, you know, and on more things than one. <laughs> <clears throat> but, unfortunately, we are closed for renovations. But that doesn't mean you have to leave, of course. No. <laughs> I mean, we can do other things. You're already here. <laughs> we, we can just hang out. We're looking for a man in August. We're supposed to meet him here. You know anything about that? Oh, sure. Sure. Why didn't you say so? Huh? <laughs> You're late, actually. Yeah, we know. Yeah, if you want to buy something strange and illegal, this is certainly the place to do it. Er ist also doch nicht tot, wie es dem Anschein hatte. Ein ziemlich komischer Zeitgenosse. My grandpappy, he's the one who came. He was a real thinker. 
You know, a real lover of animals. <laughs> Still is, actually, because he's definitely not dead. But the place itself... What happened? You get stuck in traffic? You Hyperion guys, you're usually so punctual. Getting ten million together can't be too much trouble for you guys. I assume you'd have that kind of scratch as walk-around money. Oh, well, excuse me. I, I don't know if you heard the explosions outside, but, you know, we had to mow down about a couple hundred bandits just so we could ring the goddamn doorbell. Just in time for the spring collection. <laughs> yeah, well, that's Pandora for you. If it ain't a friggin' bug stampede, some jerk-off is using you for rocket practice. All right, well, <laughs> I'll just leave you to your business things then. I'm August, but I figure you know that already. <laughs> Sick guy with a key. Is uh, is Vasquez coming? Vasquez? <laughs> he was just the go-between, the middleman, the puppet, the pigeon. Stop. I'm the one who's buying the key. Yeah. Well. I guess as long as you got the money, one Hyperion bootlicker's as good as another. So, what's your name? Just so we're on, uh, equal footing. It's Reese. Reese? Reese. Isn't that what I said? Sure. Just sit down and let's do this so we can move on with our lives. Okay, so. Let's see the money. Cash only for this deal. And I hope you brought big bills. The kind that are hard to break. Show him the money, Vaughn. No problem. Oh, okay. Uh, sorry. Uh, it's all the passwords on this thing. What's the problem? It's not a problem. It's a security thing. Just give him a second. Maybe this will give you some incentive to hurry it up. See anything so pretty in your miserable lives? This thing will practically dance at your wedding. State of the art alien crap. I'd use it myself, but you know, the monsters and all. It's goddamn gorgeous. Freaking A right it is. Okay, so the way I uh, usually do these things. Is... Wait! What? I. Oh, I just don't like it. I got a. I got a feeling. What feeling? Look! You said when I started to get a feeling about something that I should tell you and that we should walk away, right? What are you possibly feeling right now? We're almost done. I get intuitions about this stuff. We're good here. Everyone relax. We just want to buy the key from August and go. Yeah, he just wants to buy a key. From me. Sasha, what the hell are you... I just... I just don't like it. They've had this... Dumb attitude on their dumb faces since the moment they walked in. What are you talking about? They've been all, oh, yes, sir, and oh, no, sir, and oh, I have the money we agreed upon right here. Nothing you're saying is bad. Nobody does that. And especially Hyperion ore monkeys who'd rather bomb a small village than talk things through. I mean, look at that guy. Look at his face. <laughs> What's wrong with his face? You can't trust a face like that. He's hiding something, August. Hey, Sasha. Sasha, listen to me. I, I'm asking you to please trust me on this one. I know you don't trust Hyperion. Yeah, you think? And I know you have zero reason to trust us, but I'm telling you, we are not like those assholes. In, in fact, we're trying to get back at one of the worst assholes up there, and we need that key to do it. So please, take the money and let us screw over one of the biggest jerks on Hyperion. Please. So you're saying this key will get used to screw over some wretched Hyperion stooge? That's exactly what we're saying. All right, I'm sold. Awesome, let's do this. Well, just wait, just wait. Uh, August, everything's fine now. I mean, I don't know. I mean, if you really think... No, no, it's okay. The feeling's gone, August. Let's do the deal. I don't know. Maybe today's not right for this. If, if, if things are weird, 
if you ha have a feeling about this. No, 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 I was wrong. We should definitely do it. August, come on, I need that key. Promises were made and and, and, and my bosses are expecting... No, I'm, I'm sorry, guys, I was... I thought I was gonna deal with Vasquez, and now this, I just... I just think we should call it off until I, I think things are square. Maybe another time, fellas. Hun, we're here. We should just do this. Really. No, nah, I made up my mind. August, wait! Reese, this is your department. Do something! Ich weiß nicht, was sich hinter den Sachen versteckt. Ich nehme einfach mal das hier. August. Actually, that's okay. You don't know it yet. Know what? This. This is it. You can't see that one day. Maybe ten years from now. Maybe ten months. Maybe tomorrow. You're gonna think back on right now and scream to the stars for mercy of death just so you'll not have to live in the wondering of what could have been. What if I had seized that chance by the throat? What if I had beaten my fears, taken what was so rightfully mine? What if I had won? <laughs> I am a winner, Reese. I am a winner! What a steaming load of scag crap. <laughs> well, look who decided to show her face. I was just about to get to my favorite part. You know, where you come in and ruin my life, you no-class scheming Pandoran scum! A oh, nice haircut, you lying Hyperion jackass. It is a nice haircut! Oh, shut up! Stop it, stop it! You're getting dirt in my eye! It sucks, because I'm trying to get it in your lying mouth! <laughs> all right, all right! <coughs> Mission accomplished! <coughs> and I'm not lying, okay? I'm embellishing. And how the hell would you know anyway? You weren't at the deal. Of course I was, you dope. I can't believe you still haven't figured that out. I knew you were dense the moment I... Your turn, Fiona. My turn for what? Tell me your side of the deal. You couldn't have asked me first? You kidnapped me hours ago. I guess I could have. You guess? I've been baking in the sun with Rax dive-bombing me for the last... Oh, okay, I get it. <clears throat> this fraud conveniently left out the most important part of this whole thing. Which is? Oh, this ought to be good. No, oh, go on. I can't wait. It's, um, well, it's complicated. It's mine! Give it! Stop! What's your frickin' problem, man? Wait, 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 wait. How is that? The most important thing. Did you forget the part about it all being your fault? Oh, come on, that was not my fault. Not all of it. Are you making a face under there? I can't tell what you're thinking if... Okay, fine. But let me start at the beginning. Okay, jetzt lernen wir anscheinend noch eine andere Seite der Geschichte kennen. I was born here, on Pandora, in a city cast in shadow known as Hollow Point. It's in a cave. Anyway, for a long time it was just me and my sister. Just a couple of kids stealing what we could to survive. 
Until we met Felix. We tried to nab his wallet. Not only did he stop us, he showed us how to do it better. We've been working together ever since. This is taking too long. She's waiting. This latest scam was our biggest yet. The one that would set us up for life. That sounds familiar. What can I say? A lot of these stories start out the same way. Fiona, relax. There's nothing to be nervous about. There. That looks good. If Augustus's offense worth his cut, he'll be selling it to some Hyperion stooge. It should be good enough to fool one of them. Not too many people have seen a vault key, real or otherwise. The paint may still be wet. Be sure not to let anyone touch it. There are only a couple spots to worry about, but it's best not to risk it. So have them keep their hands to themselves. Do you think this will work? If I didn't, we wouldn't be doing it. Hey, you're a pro. This is what you do. Your sister may have brought in the mark, but you're the one that'll close the deal by playing whatever role you need to, to get the job done. If she introduces you as a tiny psycho, you'll squat down and scream about poop trains. Okay? That first introduction is who you are. You two have to work together. You can count on me, Felix. I know. It's just nice to hear it out loud sometimes. Showtime. Fiona, when she gives you your role, you play it as best you can. The deal came together much faster than I'm comfortable with, but it's worth the risk. So it's best to take precautions against the unforeseen. The Purple Skag is not the type of place you walk into without a backup plan. So you want me to shoot my way out? Might need a bigger gun. It's only for emergencies. One bullet. That's right. You'll always be able to talk your way out of more situations than you can shoot your way out of. Wet paint. No touch. Emergency only. <laughs> Got it. Okay. Interessant. Okay, hier habe ich auf Q Dollars, Menge Dollars, naja, so Menge ist das nicht. Oh. Das war falsch. Sick, wahrscheinlich einfach nur zu viel gesoffen. You get it all out. I guess. Was für ein Graffiti. Oh, Poster. Oh, was haben wir hier für ein Graffiti? Points, where art and culture flourish. Alright, alright, enough of the stabbing. Piss off. Um. Um. Sind wir mal ausnahmsweise nur zügig. Yeah, you're welcome. Der wird es, glaube ich, aber nicht, eh nicht mehr lange machen. So. Gucken, wo wir jetzt sind. Wir sind jetzt... Ja, der hat auch sehr gute Fast-Skills. Ouch. Wir sind jetzt hier in einer... 
Stadt in einer Höhle, in der sie aufgewachsen ist. Und ich möchte mal ihre Story halt kennen. Great. Felix didn't mention anything about a bouncer. Sorry, no one's getting in here today, pretty lady. VIPs only. Hold on. Private function. Okay. There's the Firestone Tavern down the road. If you really need a drink, they'll take care of you. Well, that's good, because I'm a VIP. What? Really? Yep. So if you could just get the door for Wait, me. Wait, one second. I don't know, miss. No offense, but you look pretty regular to me. VIPs are fancy folk. Anyway, I should have a list somewhere. Wait a second. That's you there. Your face is on that paper with that writing on it. What's that about, huh? What's them words say? And don't you lie and go taking advantage of me just because I ain't the strongest of readers. That's the VIP list, and I'm on it. They probably put a picture to make it easier on you. Well, that's a short list. I'm that important. Uh, I don't know. Out of the way, Tector. She's the VIP we've been waiting for. Dang, Sasha, why didn't you tell me she was with you? So sorry, ma'am. Huh, <laughs> can't believe that worked. I can't either. Gut, dass er der gute Mann nicht lesen kann. Wir sind jetzt hier in einer Bar angekommen, um einen Deal zu machen. Und äh, ich denke mal, das ist hier erstmal ein guter Cut. Vielen Dank fürs Zusehen. Bis zum nächsten Mal. Und dann werden wir sehen, wie sich die Gespräche hier entwickeln werden. Bis zum nächsten Mal.